Suborder Amblycera Amblycera is the most primitive suborder under Malophaga, more vagile, less host. Some species like genus of Columbicola show sexually dimorphism. The Amblycera have retained more of the habits and morphological characteristics of ancestral free living. So now, we will examine the external morphology of Amblycera. First is the antennae lie and grooves in the side of the head which may not be readily seen. As you can observe, the antennae has four to five segments. The maxillary palps are present and visible in the mounted specimens. Those that are parasitic on birds have two claws, and those that are parasitic on mammals have only one claw. Blycera in birds. Menopon gallinae, which is called the shaft louse of poultry, is pale in color. This species occurs on fowls, ducks, and pigeons, while the menopon phaeostomum occurs on the peacock. The holomenopon leucosanthum has been demonstrated causing wild feathers of dock. Birds showed soil and tattled plumage no longer repulse water, which caused them to chill and may die from pneumonia. Menacanthus tremineus, or the yellow body louse of poultry, occurs in the skin, which are not densely feathered like breast, thighs, and around the anus. It occurs on turkey Japanese pheasant and is especially harmful for the cheeks. The trinoton and sirenum may be found on the dock and the swan. For the amblycera in mammals, the species Gyropus ovalis, Gyricola porcelli, and Trimenopon hispidum may all be found on the guinea pig and some may occur in rodents. The Heterodoxus pinniger is common on the dog, especially in warm countries, while Heterodoxus longitarius and Heterodoxus macropus occurs in kangaroos and wallabies. Now, there are three suborders of Malophaga, the Amblycera, Ischnocera, and Rhynchopterina.